Hello everybody, Swift here again with another Raven's Watch run and today we're gonna be doing a run with Melusine, the most busted character in the game, Nightmare Difficulty 8 because that's the highest one I have, so we only have two revives now. And uh, why is she the most busted one? Well, first of all, she's the most unique one. Let's get a pass right away. Each four attacks hitting an enemy sends a blast all around, dealing 120% of attacks damage uh, to everybody. And counter resets when sync stance. So I'm going to take that because I know it's good. And let me explain what's happening. So this character here has two stances. The normal stance, the moving around stance, also called, uh, what is this, move, uh, move stance, because I can move. And then we got the sync stance, which is this here. And uh, as you can see, we have like this little wisp that attacks opponents yeah i cannot move the character like the character is literally unmovable right now i can only cancel the stance which also cancels my attack so this is how we play now my abilities are an explosion around the wisp and also a wave that's it my last ability here is that i go underwater and become damage immune for a moment and that's it uh, i said that that's it a bunch of times but this character is literally i have the wisp and i just exist now the wisp is doing a lot of damage and that's why i'm saying that this character is busted and let's begin the run uh, actually, the damage has nothing to do with it. The fact that we can attack often is what has to do with it. And also the fact that you can very easily reposition, attack, 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 reposition, attack, attack, attack. Uh, the first thing we want to do instantly is go ahead and pick up the double level up. And then we're going to rotate down to the visual uh, novel over there. Why you want to do double level up right away is because you want to specifically power up that one spell we got. Um, so now, as you understand, what I have is a lot of AoE. Whenever I attack, whenever I'm stationary, after a while, explosions happen and everything around us gets hit for a lot. Uh, that's at least the idea of what this build is supposed to be. Or at least what we would like it to be. Uh, I need to clear out the fight before I can enter that, I guess. I would like to unleash opponents. Nope, I guess unleash is not a thing. Let's hit him with a wave. And you just saw the explosion there. It's like an explosion around us. That's what the explosion looks like. So uh, everything is dead. Off into this fight. I think we should have this easily. Once again, Melusine, by far the most busted character in this game. So, um, let's see how this goes. As you see, AoE on everybody. Whoa. Uh, stay away. Let's do a push. Let's go underwater because I'm a bit afraid. Explode him. Let's continue going for maybe the heal. Oh, by the way, my orb can pick up heal. Heals. So, I don't even need to move to heal if, if there is an orb on the ground. Let's jump through. Explode. Push him back. Come on. Go for the stun. Go for the stun. Go for the stun. Uh, as you see, whenever this big wave happens, it's because I'm not going to pick up a new skill. Actually, I'm going to see what the new skill is in case I want to level it up. Special uh, When special ends, add three additional waves coming backwards. Okay, special waves are longer and last longer. I'm most likely going to take this, but I want to upgrade the other one I have already. So we're going to go with two upgrades here. That makes this legendary. Now it does 160 damage AoE. And now I'm going to pick up the other thing. I'm going to say when special ends, add three additional waves that come back and deal damage. Uh, special, once again, is the wave pushback thing. There is a very specific upgrade that I want to get. Uh, that's why I checked if that was one of the upgrades we would have gotten. Uh, there is an upgrade that says whoever the wisp touches gets uh, armor. The barrier, barrier. That's like a, a bubble, I guess. Defensive bubble. Which is extremely powerful. Because you can use and abuse that thing and just get a bunch of infinite blocking pretty much. So that's the idea there. Uh oh, I think I'm super in a bad spot. I mean, it doesn't matter because this character is very good at just running. At just running and hitting opponents. That's it. You don't need to do anything else. And whenever we hit opponents, we are also getting... Um, what is, uh, we get the AoE. We get the AoE. Let's see what we're going to see. This is also going to give us a level, most likely. I think this gives you like a lot of XP. Didn't get anything. Let's go uh, heal and max health and then also coins. Actually, let's go items first, as items give you damage, and damage is going to make everything easier. Uh, although the, it already feels extremely easy with this character in the first place. As you can see, we're destroying opponents extremely fast. I'm seeing money up here, let's instantly take that. Let's continue. Uh, the, her cooldowns are low, that's I think what makes her extremely powerful. The fact that this explosion cooldown here, the one skill we're using, is actually very low. That thing is carrying us. And as you saw, I didn't even need to go there, I can just pick up the heal without... Uh, even caring. Let's go through. Let's explode him. Let's pick up the health there and let's continue. Although it feels like the health is less than what it could have been because I picked it up, but I don't think that's the case. It just feels like this. Let's go under. Once again, going under makes you uh, damage immune. I think damage immune. I'm not really sure how intangible works in this game. And everything died because we're busted. Okay, who's alive? Two stone guys are alive. Okay, still somebody's alive. More stone guys. Oh, we glitched them out. Very nice. Let's go fight and let's go ahead and fight glitches then. I'm waiting for the wave. Let's run away. Let's send them back in there. 
And these guys, whoop, he tried to attack us. Okay, I see how it is. Well, let's go over here. And let's end this. This is never gonna end. This is gonna take a year. This was a big fight. Ta -da 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 -da. Whoop. I tanked it because I thought they were gonna die faster, but they didn't. It's okay. Uh, we will heal the moment we level up, so it's okay. Let's see what we get. The term scenarios enemies with negative status effects. I don't even apply negative status effects. Uh, healing provided or received is more. Now let's go with war armor, the less uh, health I have. This is just a defense when I'm about to die, which is actually really useful for us. As I said, we can re we are really good. This character is really good at being stationary. Especially when you get the thing that says um, that you gain a shield every time you hit anybody with your passive, with your attack. That's really, really important. I'm not gonna now go ahead and go for the max life. I don't need to find any of these. I'm just gonna skip ahead over to that vitality point to become more powerful. Uh, I would like to say, let's get even more armor. Let's duplicate that. It's a decent buff to get. Nice. So I'm gonna be gaining two armor for missing health. That's really good because the more protected I am at low life, the better I'm not gonna lose life, obviously. <laughs> Like, yeah, straight up. Although at low life, armor doesn't really work as well as it would have when you're full life. But still, I do believe this is a good choice. And here we're going to go for the max life after we beat the spirits. Which should be easy enough to do, to be honest. Avoid and attack them again. Once again, as I previously mentioned, I cannot really uh, move when I'm attacking. And when I say I cannot really, I mean I literally cannot. There is an event here. It was very obvious. Uh, there is an event over here, which is what event? Oh, this is not an event. This is a this is for the elite, not for the elite, for the gathering quest. So this is the gathering quest area that we're gonna most likely need to go to in a moment. And when I go and do the other quest there, I need to get rid of the healers. The healers in general are obviously an issue. Whoop! Let's avoid. Uh, let's hit the opponents. Let's run. Let's hit the opponents again. With my wave attack. Mostly my AoE wave attack, that is. Avoid everything. And let's go push, 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 push. And push him back and stun that guy. Nice. And as I said, every four attacks we do an AoE attack. That is the main aspect of our damage. We are under. They cannot attack us. Da -da 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 let's go again. Stun him. Got him stunned. As you see, best character in the game. And it's gonna explode. Let's see what we're gonna find. Heroes crossed by attacking shield. This is what I wanted. Hold defense to move underwater. Cross enemies become vulnerable. No, we're gonna go here. We're gonna go my shield defense. Give defense. Which is insane and busted. Completely busted. Because now I can make myself immortal pretty much. Uh, can I hit by doing the wave? Ah. Oh, I can. So close. I would not be able to gather them up though. And they would also expire and we would lose all the money. But uh, now we know that we can break the stones from below. Uh, might as well get the free kill there and also the free heal Right now every time I shoot out my orb It's gonna instantly give us the armor because it literally shoots out from my body So I can do this and this and this like I can always reset my shield whenever I need to Which is completely insane and busted as I previously mentioned already Okay, let's take these and let's just leave uh, Although there is a lot of money to be made over here and I'm gonna lose a life uh, Not money though XP is what I meant to say. There is a lot of XP to be gotten here uh, which is the reason as of why I didn't actually leave them all be. And let's continue. I got a lot of XP, very nice. And I also have a lot of shielding now. Uh, I think the time has come to go over to the this event. This event in general is busted. Just to be clear. If you clear that event, you, you just gain so much power. It's uh, completely insane. But uh, because that event is also hard, I would say let's try to maybe first get any other thing done. And then I'm gonna go over there. Okay, this here is also part of that event, so I would say let's actually try to clear this out before I start that event. Let's go underwater. Let's attack. Da -da 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 -da. And the wave comes back. Let's run. Whoa, I'm dying. Whoa, I'm dying. Let's hit whatever we can. As we said, every four attacks we get a free... We get a free AoE. Nope. Okay, we somehow survived that. Nope. The first important thing, the most important thing in general, is to get rid of the healers. Like, the healers are too much. Stay away from me, please. And it's not only one healer, it's like a lot of them. That's the main issue. Oh, I think we're dead. We still have two healers. Can I please get... Are you serious right now, man? Yeah, okay, so... It's okay that we lost, by the way, we have two revives. 
But I have to say the following. The dev needs, like the devs, this is the one thing they need to make 100% happen. Like, I, I don't even accept any other thing here. They have to make it so that healers cannot heal healers. Like, nothing else has to change. The only thing that has to change is that healers cannot heal healers. Because you get like an, if, if you get three healers fighting you, it's really bad. Like, they're just healing each other and you're not going to be surviving this. Um, I mean, you will be surviving as long as you're surviving, but you won't be, it, it will take you like a year to get the fight through the fight. Uh, assassin tries to hit us. Let's try to maybe get rid of the assassin. Leashed? Are you serious right now? We unleashed? We deleashed? I don't know how to, how to express what that is called. Let's hit them. Okay. This guy's by, hard, by far the hardest. Like these guys here. The spiders are also pretty hardish. Because of the entangled thing. You know what? I can definitely shield myself up again. As long as I'm shielding myself up, we should be good. I have one more revive. Okay, we clear this out. I think the time has come to actually activate the event now. Because uh, by activating this event, we're most likely gonna uh, get the same fights we just did. Are you serious right now? <laughs> Let's clear out maybe. Da -da 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 Stun them. Did we get hit? I don't think we got hit. Stay away from me. Let's definitely not be in there when that happens. And we got a healer as always. Let's also heal from the, from the orb. Whoa, that was a lot of damage. I lost the life for no reason. Let's go. I'm good at this. Okay, the one with this there and the other one is there. Nice. Both of them are already... Uh, on the map visible. Uh, and theoretically, nothing new should spawn. No way. The event respawns things? Well, if that's the case, I wasted so much time for no reason whatsoever. Uh, it's okay, though. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, obviously, it's not okay, but... Uh, what, what alternative do I have? I don't think I have any alternative right now, anyway. And I cannot take time back. Which is, in my opinion, very meh. Like, the devs were like, you know what? We're not, we're, we are gonna anti-cheese this so that people cannot actually do what I just did. Yeah, but at the same time, what you fail to realize is that, well, if you're gonna anti-cheese it, then how about not having um, enemies there in the first place, right? I should not have had a thousand hard enemies here protecting this zone if you're gonna introduce an anti-cheese mechanic and actually remove them from the zone. So, I don't know. Unless it's just a revive thing. Unless it's just the fact that, you know, um, these things revive or whatever, and I made the mistake of thinking that it, they don't revive. Maybe maybe that's on me, you know. If that is the case, then it is actually on me. So, anyway, it doesn't matter. Let's continue. We're gonna go ahead to the other zone that I also cleared out previously. Uh, so I got 10 wood. Theoretically, the other zone should have another 10 wood. Yeah, I'm not gonna get hooked by this. Very famous last words, although, but uh, I, I think I would not get hooked anyway. Uh, we still have one more revive, which... I don't think we even need, but you know, we will definitely need. Let's get rid of this guy first and foremost before I go into this area. Because we know that random opponents are going to appear in a moment. We know that. Here they are. Let's snipe this guy too. Okay, more opponents are incoming. Let's do the wave. No. Oh, come on! No! I got stunned by what? I got stunned by what? I did the... I was spamming the damage immunity, by the way. That's why I'm saying I got stunned by what? Let's do this. Nice, stun them. I got a level, so I'm full life. Very nice. That was lucky. Extremely lucky, that is. Let's avoid that. Let's also avoid this. This guy spawning a pets a million times per second is also a bit tiring, but it's okay. Uh, what would I like to get now? I would like to get my right click explodes twice. Let's see, can I get it? Defense triggers powers effect with 30%. This is when I when I use defense, I activate my right click. Power applies chill. Now we're gonna go defense. So when I do this, it explodes. That's what I got as my last one. Now from these choices, I, if I could throw something out, I would say this one, the special thing, because you can do a build that is only your right click. Uh, the, like there is an ability that says when you do this, uh, the explosion that is, it happens twice. I got 20 boxes, I got 20 wood. Like if you do this, boom, it happens again after a second. And then you do the dive and that thing also happens after a second. So it's like just chain reactions of explosions. Uh, so there is the wave build, this ability build, and there is also the explosion build, uh, which, um, you know, now I'm doing a mixed build because, you know, there is no rerolls in this game. So if the game decides to give you a mixed build, then you're forced to do a mixed build. Okay, this is ready. And it seems like when you have it ready earlier, it just uh, zeroes down the timer, which in my opinion is very good because this way you can actually achieve more things. Yeah, you go inside there and hide. I'm going to clear out here whatever is hitting us. 
That guy's toast. Uh, let's in general get rid of spirits. Uh, you know what? Let's go over here and do a. Da -da 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 Let's avoid definitely no reason for us to take damage. You know what? I want to be as close to the building as possible. So when the AoE explosion happens, I um, all of them get hit. That's why I tried to say. I got weakened. That means we do less damage. But it's okay. It's an explosion. Very nice. Let's go over the other side. Uh, the AoE is not hitting everybody, but it's gonna hit most of them. Nope, it did hit everybody. Very nice. And we want to da 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 I'm not gonna care about the right side because they're low life and they will all die at the same time anyway. That's the trick of the AoE, man. The power of the AoE. Oh, look, a healer. How about we get rid of the healer as fast as we possibly can? How about that? Is that, is that a healer? Nope, the healer is at the top right. Let's go over here, making the healer not hit us. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, actually, the healer hitting us or not is irrelevant. Us doing AoE everywhere around the tower is the relevant part. Because I don't want to need to hit literally everything. Uh, let's also not forget that every time I bubble myself, I gain a crazy armor piece. And that can literally make us immune to death. Look at this. Look at this here. They can't do anything to us. I'm gonna even showcase it at the, at the final boss. Like, I can just be here, hitting this guy, and at the same time also healing myself. And I will never ever die. As long as I'm next to whoever is attacking me. And we won. Nice. We got 750 XP. That's why kills are useless, because you get so much XP out of the quests. Uh, gain plus one health every time you collect orb. That's good. Uh, fully heal at start day and night. Mech. Uh, dashing heals half of your health that you just lost. This is decent. I think we're going to go with Vitality, though. Uh, this is actually really decent. No, I'm, I think we're going to go with Vitality, still. We are still early enough in the game where we should find, I don't know, 10 orbs. Is it worth it if I find 10 orbs? I think at 20 orbs it's worth it. So I have 10 vitality right now. Let's see if I'm going to have 3 at the end of this. Obviously, we're going to still chase orbs. This is a elite stage. Yep, we just found an elite area. That's useless, obviously. Yeah, specifically because I don't have a key. Let's see what else we can find. Spawn money. Very nice. Maybe dash healing could be good. I have never taken dash healing. Is there something here? I don't think there is something here. Oh, we found the key. Very nice. Let's stay away from the hook. Now let's fight for the key. Nice. Oh, you're dead. Whoop. Let's go underwater. Bye-bye, you guys. Let's stay away. She's stunned. AoE again. Man, the AoE is the most awesome part of this character by far. By far, the most awesome part of this character is the fact that she has so much AoE. And you can just so much do damage to everybody. Like, this part here is the, the weak part of her. The, the single target DPS. But the AoE, oh man, oh man. Oh man, oh man. Stay. Whoa. I died! Perfect. One more life. And the last life, that is. One last life. I I didn't think I had cooldowns. I don't think I made a mistake. I mean, I did make a mistake because by definition I died. Uh, but, you know, I don't think I did make a mistake. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Into the... Oh, there was a chest here. That's even better. A red chest even. That's even better. Even better than the even better. You know what? Let's be here in the middle and just shield myself until everything dies from AoE. Is that a good idea? I don't think so. Does it work? Yes, but just not a good idea. I'm inside poison right now. Stay away from that. Let's go over to this side and let's do a push. Oh! <laughs> yeah, honestly, the one ability I don't really, I didn't really want to have the the push pull wave thing. Ah, it doesn't really matter. Still. Let's go underwater. Let's go attack the spider again. And at this point, should be dead. Very nice. And we got a level. The final level. The ultimate level. Which gives us ultimate. Which is just, we become damage immune. We get into a giant spear. And then a, a sphere. And at some point, it explodes. Power cooldown. Power is my right click. This is really good. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go with this. This is my right click, as I said. Let's go and fight the elite. In my opinion, this is a pretty easy-ish elite. Boss awakens in a day. Please allow me to activate this. No, because the spider is chasing us. I'm waiting for the spider to unchase. It's not only the spider, it's also that guy. Well, now we're, uh, we have a normal fight in our hand. Let's right click. Let's get our shield back. You know what? This character with two, char with two players is insane. Because imagine the other person being melee. I got hit for seven, for example, right here. So imagine the other person being melee. And you're just, you know, shield, 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 shield. You just win. 
two minutes for this boss fight. Okay, I got this. Da -da 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 -da. I dashed away theoretically. I dashed away theoretically. 20 damage taken right here. I did not know that this guy is shooting out a huge ore, by the way. This is the first time I'm seeing this. Hit, hit, hit. Explosions. Hit, hit, hit. Explosions. Uh, I think now what the boss is going to do is it's going to go under. But my plan is very... No, no, I wanted to one-shot it. I wanted to ultimate. That was my plan. Okay, I I'm not gonna care about all of these guys. We're gonna just ulti. Da -da 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 Boom! That's what the ulti does. Let's start picking up some spirits. We also get a vitality out of them. Bye bye you guys. And we won every we beat everything. Now the boss is gonna come back. I wanted to ultimate the boss as I as I, as I just mentioned. Da -da 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 -da. Let's go again. Nope. I need to shield myself, man. Oh, It's okay. We stunned. At this point, this should be a win, right? Yeah, we won. Very nice. And we got my health. And let's see what legendary we get. Uh, Black Lotus. This got nerfed, by the way. Healing orbs no longer healed, but you get lifesteal. 100% damage on my right click, but it doesn't listen. Uh, over 50 vitality, but lose all your crit chance. Uh, let's go with this. Let's go 50 vitality, but you lose all your crit chance. It's not like we're critting anyway. Right? Yeah, it's not like we're critting anyway. Let's go. Uh, unless, you know, there is a built-in crit chance on every character. But still, even if it's a 10% damage loss, um, it's okay. It's still not really that crazy. I would like to find a chest as my last event. To find max life. Uh, and, and full heal, for that matter. Is this, is this a worthwhile event for us? I'm not sure. There is a chest down there. Oh, let's go underwater. Okay. First of all, I have to say, I do want to heal now, now that I lost this much life. You know, now that I lost this much life, might as well go for the heal. Avoid that, idiot. Let's go. Da -da 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 -da. Try to... I went underwater by mistake. Stay away from me. That guy got stunned now. Might as well go for him. Da -da 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 -da. Hit the other thing. Nice, got every kill. And let's now get full heal. And now let's go get a legendary chest, because this is a red. Uh, red, I mean, on the map it's red. Therefore, it's going to be a better chest than normal. Then, oh, and a red. Whew, this is godlike. Uh, okay, uh, definitely, definitely, this is more important than the chest. Definitely. I can guarantee you that much. So, let's take the important one. Oh, I didn't play this correctly. Ah, it is what it is. I have an idea on how to cheese things. We want to be in the middle, so we hit everything. Yeah, and now we're gonna do da 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 and now we're gonna do ultimate, and now we're gonna do boom, everything dead. Nice. And now we're just killing some spiders, and we won. Easy enough. So this thing gives you four upgrades, okay? Here it is, four upgrades. I'm not gonna take it now, I'm gonna leave it there. I wanna test something out. And that test is called, can you cheese this? So you go here, you go to the teleport, right? I have 180 coins. Let's see how much cheese exists in this game. Uh, I hope this is going to stay like this forever, by the way. Uh, then you buy everything that costs cheap. 50 and 100. And I just made a mistake because 1, 2, 3 upgrades. Uh, therefore, I should have definitely only bought 2 of them. I should have bought 2 because now we're going to get 4 upgrades. And obviously, two, 1 of them is going to go in the bin. Because I only have accessibility to 3 more upgrades. Yeah, I made a mistake here. Uh, so, we're going to buy 4 upgrades. Boom. And now everything I have is legendary. So, that means this does 35% damage. This, uh, the shield is 25 and I do nine, uh, the waves that come back to 95% damage, and my OE is 160. So, definitely could have min-maxed a bit better, just a bit better, but you get the meaning, right? I could have had 100 more coins, that's the more min-max. But if I had 4 upgrades, then this would have been better. Yeah, I, I, I would have made it the correct way. So what I just did was the not that many version. Uh, too many, too many, too... Yeah, my, my skills were already powerful enough version, What was what that was. Dive in. Go to our side. Let's go again with hitting these guys. Let's pick that spirit up. I really, really enjoy that. I don't even need to go over to where the spirit is. I just pick it up for free. Let's see what ability we got. Vitality for each magical object carried. That's a lot of vitality. Defense gain charges. Who cares? Dash cooldown. Uh, now we're going to go with even more vitality. 110 vitality, that is. Uh, will I find one last event? I don't think so. Uh, I don't have money for the shop. The cheapest thing in the shop costs 75, so there is no reason to go to. The event I got was the two more. That's completely useless. So we just got a completely useless event as our last event. Uh, I also boxed myself in. So now we just... Uh, yeah, we just won for the next 30 seconds. Maybe I'm gonna find an event. Maybe not. 
I have zero revive, so I should perfect the boss. I, I have to perfect the boss. There is no I should. Straight up, I have to perfect the boss. Otherwise, we are not able to... Uh, yeah, we're gonna lose otherwise. We're not gonna be able to. We're not gonna be able to what? I think I lost the most time. That money is not enough. I think I lost the most time specifically on... What is it? Do I have 75 coins? Nope. Wow, I got like 16 coins out of that. You don't get money in this game. If you don't get a lot of money in this game. I don't think there was anything down here either. Yeah, this is like a you find root event. You find um, wood. Yeah, this is the you find wood event if there is the, um, the other event that says build me a wooden house. Okay, time to fight the boss with Melusine. Let's see how this is gonna go. Let's skip the cutscene and let's hope for the best. Now, how this is gonna go, we're gonna see. Whoop, let's avoid that. We're not very high on damage, just to be clear. But we do a lot of damage. That doesn't make sense. I mean, sentence-wise, it definitely doesn't make sense. Whoop. Let's avoid the one-shot. By the way, literally, the one-shot is the only thing that I have issues with. Uh, I can definitely just stay here and tank everything. Yeah, that's what I should definitely do. Like, just, just, uh-oh. Jump up. They want to go back there. So I should always just do this. I stay next to the thing, and we just shield ourselves. I should not be able to lose life as long as I'm doing this. Other than the boss life, obviously. It's not this, this slammer hitting us. But otherwise, I mean, look at my shielding. I have 226 life. Let's see if I'm gonna lose life. 226. 226. I, uh, I, I have 197 now. <laughs> so, cancel my plan. Bye-bye you. Whoop, laser. I'm not sure if... Ooh, we lost a lot of life there. Lost another six life. I don't... I'm not sure that this plan is actually as good as I'm making it out to be. Ultimate time. Pop it. Wave. That's a thing I didn't do once yet. <laughs> attack, attack, attack. Attack, attack, attack. Attack, attack, attack. Yeah, we're very much on the lower end of damage. In comparison to all the other characters we ever had. I just got hit for seven. Okay, wave. Okay, got that one. And continue healing. I don't even need to go over there. We can attack from here. What's the boss doing? Laser beams. Okay, we avoid those. Well, and instant death after that. And yeah, this might be my first loss, by the way. This might be my first loss with Lucene. Or not. Who knows? I mean, let's not forget that I'm also gaining more armor the less health I have. Uh, okay, this thing again. Let's attack over there. Let's go over here. Wave! Da -da 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 Let's avoid. Uh, maybe avoid. I uh, most likely avoid, actually. I avoided most of the things. Laser laser beams. Wave! Let's avoid again. Attack from afar. That's the one thing she's good at, though. Attacking from afar. Spikes are incoming. You know what? Because there is no reason to get damaged by spikes or anything. Let's avoid again. Wave. Da -da 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 Yep, and the boss got stunned. So we go close. We go close because I want to be able to do the waves. Waves. Okay, ultimate is about to appear. Maybe I should have slowed down a bit more just so that I get more ultiers out. Okay. You know what I'm thinking about? I'm thinking about the less health I have, the more armor I gain. And maybe that's the play. Whoa, no, that was a mistake. I lost 40 life right there. This might be the end, you know... Whoa. Let's hit a lot of times. Let's go away. If any of these hit us, we're dead. We are dying. Sift so be like, Lucene Immortality. Look at this. And Immortality shall not exist. Mortality is not a thing. Oh, that guy's dead. Well, that was bad. Because I saw there was health on the ground and I didn't pick it up. So now we're clutch, clutch moments again. Need to go away from this. You know, um, the worst part is when both of these things uh, synchronize. The enemy slam plus the um, plus the rain. This rain here is not an issue. But when the when the tentacle slams while that thing is happening, that's the issue. Let's avoid the rain. Nice. Come on, ultimate time. Nice, got him. Ultimate! Boom! Not that it does a lot of damage, but... You know, it is what it is. Rain! Water! Lucene, the low damage character. Doing it. Slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. Okay, spikes are incoming. At least I'm learning the patterns. <laughs> I mean, I'm learning when he does them, not to avoid them specifically. Laser incoming. 
You know what? I allow that guy to survive with slow life. Stun him. Yeah, I got hit, but whatever. Healed, very nice. Laser, the worst one. In my opinion, the laser is the most deadly one. This is obviously the most deadly one by definition. The slam that instantly kills you. But the laser is the one that you can just get hit by and then just die. While this thing, you know, yes, it does damage you, but you can definitely avoid it. While the laser is not really that avoidable if, if you're in a bad spot. You see, because they just decide to fire on you the moment the, the, the time comes. You see, I can stutter step this easily. Rain, stun him. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Got this guy too, very nice. And this guy is gonna have a low life because we damaged previously. So let's just end this here. Whoa. Easy enough. Nice. Now we're gonna do with everything we have. And next one is gonna be a win. Once again, maybe should have synchronized with my ultimate. But it's okay. Seven seconds down. Yeah, now we're not doing damage anymore. Nope. You know, as long as I have a shield... No matter what's happening, we're good. Whoa. Whoa. Zigzag. You know what? Allow that for last. It's spikes incoming. Nice. It's slammed. Dead. Very nice. Let's go over there. I don't even need to be next to them. Uh oh. What water? Whoa, run! Still alive. Run! Still alive. Panic mode. <laughs> Stun this thing. Okay, very nice. I can stutter step, as always. Yep, that did hit us. Laser, let's go away. Ooh, I think we would have died there. I think we're gonna die here. You know what? I think I destroyed projectiles if, um, if I attack and then dash. Like, this attack dash seems to have a destroyed projectile mechanic going on. That thing's dead. Laser incoming. And this guy's low life anyway. Let's go. Ultimate explosion! 400 damage. And we won. Up one says 100 life. 90, 60, 30 explosion. Easy win. With one life. Melusine is busted. I love her the most. I love her the most. Like, my most liked character. Especially in co-op. Like, imagine this shielding bubble that I had. Um, on, an, on a melee helper, right? You can always be like, fling, defend, 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 defend. 1,400 damage taken with 200 max life. Can you realize? Like, I took 1,489 damage while I had 150-something life in the beginning, and then later we got 200. So that's why she's so awesome. We unlock Nightmare Difficulty 9. Uh, attack damage increased by 8% for each enemy hit, up to 6 hits for the damage resets. Uh, if, if, if we take damage or... If she exit the stance. Well, the way I, we were playing this was would, would be really good. And uh, I guess in Legendary version, this is going to be like plus 15 damage per hit. A maximum 100 damage. So this would be insane. Power deals 50% damage at its center. That's the explosion thing. Damage went full health. Special deals 100% damage, but has an increased cooldown. Eh, whatever. So, yeah. That was the run with Melusine. From tomorrow, we're going to continue going on around. Now that I realized every single character on how to play them. Maybe Beowulf again. Maybe Scarlet again. Maybe co-op with a friend. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Anyway, if you enjoyed, drop a like inside the channel. If you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed. I definitely like this. And as always, thanks for watching. And see you guys around.